We know a lot about the early solar system through our studies of meteorites. The meteorites, when they come into the Earth's atmosphere, burn up and they burn off a lot of the surface and they lose that skin. And it's that skin which has the, the record of how the asteroid has evolved in the solar system. So what we're trying to do is, is reach out into the solar system, grab a sample, bring it back, and try and understand the history of those objects and those asteroids around uh, planet Earth. Well, Hayabusa 2 is going out on, a, on an orbit to intersect with asteroid Ryugu, and Ryugu's orbiting somewhere between Earth and Mars. So we're hoping to get skin samples which have got embedded radionuclides and things which we can date the surface and get an understanding of the recent history of our solar system. So SHRIMP is a novel piece of technology, does microscale analyses of chemistry and isotope. We use a focused iron beam to, to sample uh, very small areas of, of mineral grains. And so ANU will receive a sample directly from the surface of an asteroid. And so having the capability to actually analyze on the microscale is going to be complementary aspect of, of these uh, observations that we're getting around the asteroid at the moment. And we can uh, basically make our contribution to the understanding of the solar system.